morning guys we are home already we're sitting in the driveway it is at 12 o'clock lunchtime we packed that trailer up and we got out of there this body was saying i don't know if you can see but this body was saying if you go in the sun one more minute i'm not gonna make it so we had to get out of the sun how did you feel going home uh, were you i thought you wanted to stay yeah, the girls wanted to stay, and Sophie made a little friend that lived next door to us at camping, right? Overall, though, that was an awesome camping trip. I finished an entire book while we were shut while we were camping. I got to rest and relax. The girls got to swim all day, right? Mm -hmm. You sat in the sun all day. I sat in the sun all day. What a dummy I am! Because it was so cold out. It was nice and cool. We were on a mountain. It was breezy. Sophie got sunburned because Sophie, it doesn't matter how much sunscreen I put on her, she always gets a little red in the sun. But anyway, we are headed out to see a farm. 50 acres, you guys. And that is the house. 50 acres. Wow. Nobody's here for the open house, but we are. So nice. So uh, this house is not a house that we're going to buy. It's over a million dollars, but they're having an open house and we decided to come and see. This would be our dream home. Aww. Nice puppy. Yeah, you Don't jump on me. Cheap. I have a sunburn. I do not want any jumping on me. Center hall plan. Goes upstairs, family room, living room. Cute little dining room. Goes into the kitchen. I'll look at the kitchen later. All right, let's go down this way. Yeah, two sets of stairs like our house now. Okay. This is what's the living room? Formal living room. And then that's the family room. Bathroom. It's beautiful. Yeah, you could put the clothes in and then go pee and then. Just uh, this is a good shower for dogs. Okay, so this is a nice office. Oh, okay, so this is another family room. This is like a den. I had to walk on the carpet because it's so nice. So a den. And then an office. They have horses out there. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to go out there. Nice. And then there's a big deck out here. Nice field. Sam, get off their furniture. Get up. Be locked out. So family room. Porch. Let's look at the kitchen. Look at the kitchen. Gas stove. Ovens, microwave, island, fridge. All right, gorgeous kitchen. You like the kitchen, like the lamp? I like the gray color. Okay. Wow, it's big up here. Bathroom. All right, so first we hit a bathroom. Oh! There's the dog. I like the showers. Horse pastures and the dog. Yeah, this is a nice room. The carpet is amazing. Look at the dog. He's in the pond. <laughs> the dog is in the pond? That's why he's stinky. Oh, that's why he was wet, right? Oh. <laughs> this is cute. This is my room. This would be Why room. couldn't you share the room? You guys no, like sleeping together anyway. Yeah. Look at the cute like little makeup area over there. That's adorable. The closet's nice. I wish we were, I wish we were rich. Yes. So it's two rooms across from each other. Closet. And then just a huge walk-in closet. Oh, this is neat. So then you have to walk down the stairs. Oh, okay, so this is like a roughed-in master bedroom. 
Homeschool room. Home, homeschool room. No, this is the master. You <laughs> She's like, I'm having that other bedroom. So I'm having. I didn't. Probably down the road, but this is like. Yeah, I didn't see the master yet. This is it would be a perfect homeschool room. Yeah. So it has garage. in. So what about air? Does it have air? This is above the garage, though. There's no. It's hot. Air. But you could put something in. It's very nice, though. That down there has got to be the eat-in breakfast area. All right, we're missing a master bedroom. Here's a room. Okay, so room there, room there, this and then a bathroom. So then, another bedroom, adorable bedroom. This is the master. And then this is the master. Holy moly. So that is a bathtub that I could. I said, guys, I recommend get it. It's a million dollars. It's over. I like the showers, how they don't go up that high. No, but there's a tub there, and that's oh. what I like. There's two entrances for the room. There, there. Okay, so then this is this the closet. Is the oh my gosh. Put some stuff in here. You could sit down while you get dressed. Wow. So it's not quite ready. I look beautiful. You do look beautiful. Oh okay. gosh, do you like my necklace? You look sunburned. So my pony necklace. Bird. All right, let's keep going. Big upstairs, long hallway, bedrooms all the way to that end. Oh, oh, I want to Four bedrooms up here. Oh, okay. So a closet there. And then... Oh, nice. So then there's this little thing here too. Little hallway. Well, it's super cute. What? The view down the stairs to the front entrance. Oh, so this is the front porch. Don't let him in. He's like, yay, oh my goodness, don't come to me. And then the Property goes up that hill, it goes all the way back. It's probably no, it's a girl. I definitely want to go look at those horses. Okay, let's go. Um, it's a girl. Oh, Gabby. So, this is the garage. Hey, girl. And we're going to head out and look at the barn. It's actually set up as a workshop right now, but they have horses on the property. So, we're going to go look at them too. Oh, so bright. And the dog has adopted us. <laughs> And so we could go up there. It's 58 acres, she said. Oh, yeah. Of hay. Okay, so this is the barn. With the doggy! This would be a good barn. Yeah, because you could even keep all the workshop stuff over there and put two paddocks over here and have a big shelf. Yeah, we're going to. Oh, there's a bird's nest. Oh, yeah, a bird's nest. You have to change the windows so we don't smash them. Yeah. Put bars on the windows, but look, this could be a whole, like, you could put one, two, three stalls. Yeah, I mean, it would be nice and roomy. Doors open, it'd be nice and, cool. and it wouldn't be that much work, would it? Yeah, so we just need a get-rich-quick scheme. Okay. Apparently that dog needs some kids. All right, let's go check out that. Is that ours? Yeah. And this is the back of the house. We'd need a pool, some kind of a pool. Three Belgians. Is that what she said? They look like Belgians. There's four of them there, though. There's like five horses in there. Oh. So, wow, look at that hill. That's a toboggan hill if I ever saw one. They got water right there, too. A pond? Yeah, and the ground is like, they must have lots of water. It's wet. They're Belgians. What do you but think? See, the building's already there for them. Yeah, and it's on this property. Guys? What? Oh, pretty, right mu pretty muddy in there, though. Like the dog better than the horses. Really? That's a fun dog, huh? Oh, he's okay. You coming, horsies? Don't touch the. Penny. No, they're like, it's all muddy. Touch the wires. All muddy. We're not coming. Look, that's all mud though. Yeah. 
It's pretty wet down here. <coughs> They're pretty though. If you had apples, then I like that kind of horse. Oh, here comes one guy. Well, that's just for them to. Oh, one's coming. Now they're all coming. Nope. One brave one. It looks young. He's afraid. They're afraid. They're afraid of the dog. <laughs> so these are the neighbor's horses. They're just staying here. They look skinny. Are they, they young? Look young? Yeah. There's one pony in there. All right, let's look at the pond. Dog is like. Come to my pond. Oh my gosh, she actually swims in the pond. She's probably full of blood suckers. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. That dog is hilarious. The pond is cute though. Goes all the way back there. Guys. Good for the dogs. If we had got this pond, well, this house and farm, I wish the dog would come with it. Yeah, imagine our little dogs going in there. Poor Toby would fall over and drown. Well, that's a good swim hole for the dog, though. He's cool. Yep. He never I like he be uh, near him when he comes Oh out. dear. <laughs> go lay in the she pond. doesn't even shake. She just runs it off. Gonna lay in the it's funny, she's chubby oh. because there's so many hills here. Honey, come on. She went right. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. That is crazy. This woman has to it's get wet and then go in the mud. So cute though. Penny. Let's go look over there at the field and see how big it is. Penny, come on. Penny loves it. Oh, and here's Penny. So can me. And there's the property. All the way to that pool down there. We got a trailer out there. We should see what's up there. Yeah, let's go that way. Oh, it goes all the way to that pool down there, Sam? Oh, yeah, that's the road. That's the road. All these acres. Holy Guys. cow. He's like, welcome to my home. Welcome to my home. Let me show you around. She's taking us on a trail. The real estate agent, agent lady told us that there's trails through the woods. They go out all the way back to a three acre field. Wouldn't that be amazing for, uh, for like a sand ring and even a riding arena, even in a riding arena. Um, so yeah, look at how far back that goes. Can you see down there better up there? I don't know. It's gorgeous. My next life, Sam, I'm gonna be rich. And I'm gonna start young, planning for what I want. All right, we are at the, what's this store called again? The tax store? Uh, harness and equestrian supply store because Little Miss, somebody needs to get, uh, what's it called that you need? A vest. A vest. A vest. She needs to get a vest and now, her teacher told to us. Get something. And this is Charlie, my boy horse. This yeah, is her and boyfriend. I, up and ride my time. I love when they're at the age where the Good horse is their time. boyfriend. Because then I don't have to deal with real boyfriends. Oh, that's the kind of dog we want to get. What's her name? Merida. Merida. That's the kind of dog we want to get. I breathe them. I breathe oh, them. Well, could you have a car? Um, You're in the area? Yeah, I probably do. Right, yeah. give it to us. Oh, yeah. We're in the process of looking to buy a farm, and as soon as we get one, this is our next purchase after a farm. The best dogs ever. Yeah, because they have the ever. best disposition, huh? Yeah, they do. Merida. So is she a mama? She's a mama. Oh. Um, she had Let a spring see her. litter. Her home and purse. I'm expecting a litter at the end of August from one of my other girls. Wow. Do you have a website? Yes, like I do. Me. Okay. You already like me, don't you? Yeah, it's a sign. It's a I sign. This is a baby. sign, you guys. This is the dog we've been wanting to get. Irish wolfhound. Yeah, it's an Irish wolfhound, and she's not that huge. Well, she's a girl, right? Yeah, and we want a girl, right? Yeah, the boys. And she's a mama, and another dog. Sophie's taking over. So we're here because it's cute. We're here because um, we need to see what's involved in buying a vest. We don't even know anything about it. Anyway, I like this. Somebody, one of you guys suggested that we buy the girls a bag or a little bucket there, and they have all their own grooming stuff that they could take to the barn. And I think that is a fabulous idea. So we are going to look into that. Sophia's birthday's coming up. 
and I'm excited and even a saddle pad and stuff. Yeah, so I mean this bag is adorable. All right, here we go. So how is it sized? First one feels small, small, medium, and large. Small, medium, and large. You think Does that's kids? Um, I think that's a youth or uh, <coughs> adults. <I> <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He loves you. She loves small. you. Merida. Yeah, you can adjust, adjust in there. Right? You can adjust on the shoulders as well. And you can adjust up here. Let me see this. She said it has to cover your tailbone. Yes, tailbone. That's good. Is it just? Just the right size. I think she should yeah, try a medium. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah, turn around. That's, let me see. No, because look, it's it's. Yeah, there's still enough. a lot of adjustment. Oh, okay, plus, but look plus at the plus length, these. though. Yeah, but the length is. Yeah, she's not gonna do. Did she said not to get it too long because it's too. Oh, long. okay. Yeah. Then oh, okay, I don't know anything. <laughs> That's all right. Don't. She'll never bother <laughs> us. And then when you get bigger, you can like. Yeah. Or you can adjust it. Alright, so how much are how much is one of those? 170. Oh, well, that's a lot better than what we no, thought. 199.9. Oh, okay. Yeah, the the kids. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Alright. I mean, don't you? She likes the girls better, which is what I like. I don't think so. She likes you too, but she really loves the girls. Yeah. She likes kids. We are home, you guys. Sam is making burgers for supper. And he said, he just came home from shopping. And he's like, let's end this amazing long weekend. Even though it's not a long weekend. Let's end this amazing weekend with... Chocolate cake. German chocolate cake. Then I was freaking out. And I'm like, oh, I can't eat chocolate cake. Like, why do you buy stuff that, I know, that you know I love and that I'm going to want to eat? And he's like, don't eat it. And I'm like, yeah, I have to eat it. But then I saw... It's so tiny. One piece of this is going to be like nothing. So I'm having cake. I don't have to have any. It could be one half for me, quarter for Jack. I'm having cake. If you buy it, I have to eat it. That's why I try not to buy it. All right, before we end today's video, we are going to do a shout out to Astrid Landon. And she is a nine year old girl and she's a vlogging channel and it's called Astrid Gray. And she even has one called Astrid Landon. And it, I watched one of her videos, it was super cute. She made slime and she totally reminds me of Gabby, the way she said, the way she talks and the fact that she's addicted to slime. Mm -hmm. She was a really- I'm addicted to slime too. Yeah. But dad's playing with that dumb one. Yeah. <laughs> we can't stop playing with the slime, you guys. We're addicted. That anyway. slime didn't turn out. Yeah, because I made it, but anyway. No, I made um, it. So if you guys want to see somebody else that's uh, very similar to Gabby, then you should check out her channel. Like I said, it's called Astrid Gray, and she's nine years old, and she's super cute. We are also going to do a comment of the day, and comment of the day today goes to Hi Hi, and what she says is, I feel like her trainer is rushing her. I think she needs more practice on the cross rails before she does any verticals. I can jump four to five feet and I remember doing cross rails for almost two years before I did my first vertical. That's an awesome comment. So Gabby, how long have you been doing cross rails? Mm, I've done them last year. Two years. At least two years, it's true. She did them at the old bar. She's been doing them a long time. Do you do cross rails? Not yet. She's been doing them for a really, really long time. Guys, and I can't cancel oh, that's or jump. A, yeah, not yet. But you're only seven. You have lots of time, right? Mm, more like six, five, and six hundred and fifty years. She's not really six hundred and fifty <laughs> years, honestly. She's a joker. You don't think I have that much time. Oh, it feels like that's how much time you have left to wait? A oh, lot more. You don't want to be rushed, that's for sure. But anyway, we trust our instructor, and it's clear from all the comments that you guys have been giving us that horseback riding lessons are taught so many different ways. But we like our teacher, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, we do. We like her. She is a perfect fit for us. And we are happy with the way she's doing it, right? Right? And so we're just going to go with that and hope for the best. But anyway, thank you so much for all of your comments. It was a great comment. And we are going to see you guys tomorrow, right? Yeah, bye. 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 And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.